Shut that fucking music off. You only have like five tracks, max. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we got some whiskey. Some Al Breach brand whiskey. Got some Al Breach brand beer. <laughs> yeah, that's why it's the same. Uh, got a shot glass. Got some Sunset Sarsaparilla. I can offer you all kinds of things. I can offer you uh, Sweet Death. <laughs> that one's on the house. First one is free with PGNUT. <laughs> Ah, yes, take all the drugs. What the fuck is that? <laughs> What's what? What the hell is that thing? What is that? I don't know what you're talking about. What just happened? The all-seeing eye! It embraces me! How did it go? Do you have the caps? Not just the caps, but the bottles that accompany them! Oh my, that's the most wonderful news I've heard in my 80 years of living. Here's your bonus for getting them for me. What? <laughs> Unfortunately, I don't have the bee beds and flowers, but I'll send a courier to deliver them to you as soon as I can. Oh, okay. You don't- You have my eternal gratitude. Thank you so much for getting me these. But if you'll excuse me, I need to go to drink. I mean, clean these beautiful bottles. I am most definitely not going to drink these. Definitely not. You privileged motherfucker. Before you can reply, Bella runs away, catching you off guard enough that you don't see where she ran to, damn it! How did I not see where she ran to? She is definitely drinking those drinking colas, though. Well, now what? Well, I guess we wait for a courier? Oh. <laughs> I don't even know what's happening anymore. Hey, Miss Mitchelson sent me. Here are the 10 bee beds and 25 flowers she promised you. Hope you have a nice day. Oh, thank God. Thank you, bee courier guy. The postal outfit. Yeah, the Mojave Express outfit. That's <laughs> nice. Yeah, it's pretty good. It's just a maintenance jack with the logo on the back, but yeah. it is unique enough. Are you going to keep following me? <laughs> yeah. Can I have your jacket? Trade you. Well, I guess we're getting that jacket one way or the other. What's wrong with the textures on your gun, man? Who cares? You just want the outfit, right? <laughs> I mean, yeah, but what's up with that? Custom camo paint. Yay! Look, I'm a courier! You always were! The courier was inside you all along. Yay! I'm also a sheriff! Eugene! How can I help you? I have everything you asked for. That's amazing! You even got more beds than I asked for! Thanks for the help. Now, are you ready for the next task? The next? Eh, it's not going to be much. I'll just need a working terminal, two chairs, and three hats. Okay. Any hats for you? Hats aren't furniture. And also, I forgot that you said that you needed furniture as well as <laughs> other things. Because I thought we were going to be done with this quest, but we're not. Hats aren't furniture. They are if you just believe in them. <sighs> ah, it's like a, a bee bean bag. Sure. Great. I look forward to your return. Hats. 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 Uh... Come on, Zach. Let's be hasty and get these things. Be hasty. Still Ouch. like the Pancor jackhammer? I believe my spine is broken. What can- What? We have all the things you asked for, apparently. Well, that's marvelous. Once again, thanks for all the help. Here are the caps I promised you. How did I have all the things he asked for? I'm so proud of you. I know you're gonna be an excellent bee owner. I was just trying to skip through the dialogue options now that I have everything! I'm sure you're too excited to talk to an old man when you could be getting bees instead. So I'll wish you a nice day and I hope I get to talk to you soon. I got oh I got twelve caps. Alright. <laughs> so apparently we had the things that he don't wanted. How did I how did I have these things? Mm, or it could be that there's a bug in the code. A bug! Ah! <laughs> Eugene wants me to get some furniture for him, but he also asked for hats. I don't know- I didn't know hats were furniture. Then again, he also asked for a terminal. Is that furniture too now? I really don't care. I should probably search for these things at Gene Skydiving. That place will have everything I'm looking for. Alright, 
Just gotta type on your computer and all right. And the chairs. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Thank you for the nice hat you left here. It belongs to our church now. You will never get it. Sign the Church of Harvest. P.S. If you want to find us, just enter the door with the key next to this note. Oh, one of the hats is gone. It was taken by the this church. All right. Let's go kill him, I guess. <sighs> oh. oh, what? <laughs> okay. Hat, 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 hat. Uh huh. Hat, 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 hat. <laughs> what? Hat. The hat is my savior. I shall not want. It leads me through stray pastures. It leadeth me beside quiet waters. Hat. It soothes my soul. Can I offer you a hat in these trying times? <laughs> <laughs> Can I offer you an egg in these trying times? Welcome, my child. Welcome to the Cave of Harvest. Are you ready to <laughs> devote yourself to the Lord and Savior of all mankind, Teddy Roosevelt? Ah! <laughs> yes, I am. How wonderful. Here, drink this. If our Lord and Savior accepts you, you will survive. If not, that means you weren't worthy in the eyes of our Lord. Okay. Which means you were scum and not deserving to walk this plane of existence in the first place. Not gonna drink this. <laughs> That's disappointing, but I understand. You're still welcome here, of course. There's a sleeping area if you need to rest. Feel free to get something to eat as well. It's all free, too. If you ever change your mind, I'll be here to welcome you. That's very kind of you. Can we have your hat? Well, damn, they do have some food here, huh? They do have food, and they have, a. Uh... Yeah, ow. <laughs> Hello? Well then. Um. And what down the here. Oh! That's where the hat is! Ah, uh, they've got the hat in storage! What can I help you with? Can I have the key to the blocked off area of the cave? Unfortunately, only members of our church are allowed to have access to that room. You either have to join our church, or have one of our members supervise you while you visit our sacred room. Uh, can you supervise me? No, I cannot. Why? Is it because you're an inanimate object? Just ask around. I'm sure there will be someone who won't mind helping. How about you? Can I help you? Wh why do you all sound the same? Why does your kind sound all different? You know, it's not very polite to ask that. It's kind of racist, Mike. Oh, my bad. I'd like to enter the locked off area of the cave, please. As long as you don't try anything funny, I'll be happy to accompany you. All right! I would say lead the way, but with how much taller you are than me, I think it would be better if I stand on your shoulder. Okay, you can stand on my shoulder. Don't worry, I won't fall off, even if you run. Um, this is pretty great, I gotta say. <laughs> I don't have a teddy bear on my shoulder! Yeah, uh, I like this. This is great. Living the Jack and Daxter life here. Yeah. Making me jealous. Hat. You filthy thief! How dare you steal this sacred hat? There's nothing sacred about this hat! Alright, I suppose that's true. But I can't just let you leave with that hat. You'll be very upset. And since I'm the one who brought you here, you'll be upset at me. I can't have that. So why don't we make a deal? Zach, if there's nothing special about this hat, why do you insist on getting this particular one? Oh, that's a good point. <laughs> I want to see California. Now, I'm not expecting you to bring me all the way there, but a little help would be nice. I heard about the Mojave Outpost, so that should be far enough. Okay, we can put you in a shipping crate. Thanks. It's almost as if you don't have the ability to say no. <laughs> I still appreciate it, of course. Think anyone will mind? <laughs> hey, I'm gonna, I'm gonna leave. Hat. 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 All right. Hat. 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 Got it. Okay, well, see you later. <laughs> Got a teddy bear on my shoulder. Teddy bear on my shoulder. There he is. Teddy bear on... <laughs> hey, Gecko Bob! Hello. Fancy meeting you here again. I... Okay, just don't... Stop staring at me judgingly. I know you're jealous of my teddy bear. It's not even my teddy bear. He's just a friend. 
Who talks? It's not weird. This isn't weird at all, Gecko Bob. Stop judging me, Gecko! That'll learn ya. And this is the entryway to the strip. You see here that there's these robots. Right now, you're part of the Don't Taste Me Bro faction. Yeah, welcome to the team. Yep. You can't be attacked by these guys, because you're one of us. Yep. Here's the Gamora. That's where you put your penis in whores. I don't know if you have one of those. That's probably a rude question to ask. I would assume you don't, as a teddy bear. Maybe it's sheathed like dogs, I don't know. I have no idea. This is an MP from the NCR. The Ranger veterans have been running ops in Baja. It stands for military police, not member of parliament. We've been confused on that before. It also stands for military police and not major prick. We'll wait, it... wait. Oh no, it looks like Adam died. Why has nobody moved his body yet? Dear diary, looks like I'll never own a bee. The only person I know who sells bees just died. I wonder why. I'm gonna cry myself to sleep in the in morning of the bees that I never got to own. I probably should do that in that bed that suddenly appeared in the middle of the street. Night night. <laughs> the courier. <laughs> oh man, no bees for us. Oh, ah! I'm a ghost. <laughs> ah! Oh shoot, calm down, kid. Oh, okay. I didn't mean to freak you out like that. I'm sorry, but it must be a shocker to see me alive. Yeah? My corpse is only a few feet away, after all. I wonder why they haven't moved it yet. But that's beside the point. I noticed that you finally got enough caps. Which is a darn shame, as there's nobody around to sell you any bees. I know, right? I'd gladly sell you some, but as you can see, I'm dead. All the bees I had are waiting for me in bee heaven. Oh my god. Don't worry, I didn't kill them. Bees can travel between heaven and earth, you know? What? <laughs> I can tell that they're getting impatient, but I just couldn't leave like this. Thank you for stopping by. You were so eager to get yourself some bees, and now you'll never get any. <laughs> for that, I apologize, but unfortunately, there's not much I can do about that. Uh... What I can do is share some ghostly knowledge every time you need me. Just Ooh. summon me, and I'll come to share some bee wisdom. <laughs> really? Well, my bees are getting restless, so I need to go call them down. I'll see you when you need me. Goodbye, uh, Adam Benson. All right, fare be well. Man, talking about blue bees, we found blue balls. Of course, yeah. went nowhere. There should be a phone somewhere. Bees are a vital ah! element in our ecosystem. For example, they are the ones that take care of the dead bodies that you leave around the wasteland. What? <laughs> All right. Yeah, they know what you've done. I, I okay. <laughs> I wasn't aware that bees ate people. I corpses. don't think they do. Uh, that might not be a factual bee fact. I think that's false. You're confusing them with wasps. Ah, the tops. Ah! If you ever do get bees, make sure you take them to this place often. They love it here. Yeah, it's the bee's knees. I don't know what it is, but every bee I owned adores this place. Okay. Cool. Oh, Gamora. You better not take any bee here. Not if you want them to stay with you, at least. <laughs> Why are bees monogamous? Yeah, they might die. They might catch an STB. Ah. I guess once it's all said and done, this is a pretty fun adventure. It's been interesting. I will definitely say it's not the worst adventure we've ever been on. I am a little disappointed we didn't get any bees. Yeah, I was kind of getting really excited for bees, but <laughs> yeah. I guess uh, I guess no bees. Yeah. Activate working car that most definitely has all its tires. Well, sure does. Okay. Say goodbye to the teddy bear you've been carrying. You'll never see him again. I'm sure that California is a lovely place and you'll love being there. Teddy bear removed. I didn't know that teddy bear knew how to drive. That teddy bear doesn't know how to drive. He told me I had his license, but I'm looking at it right now. It's a CDL license. Why would he leave it with you? I don't know. Oh my God. <laughs> we just illegally smuggled a teddy bear into another country. Human trafficking might be illegal, but teddy bear trafficking ain't. On the plus side, now whenever you sleep, you might be haunted by a bee vending ghost. Oh, man.
This has been a terrible day. Don't worry, I'm sure tomorrow will be better! Ah! Don't worry. Be happy. Oh, no. One day, when you are older, you might get hit by a boulder. Why are you lying there screaming? Come help me, please. The seagulls mm. poke your knees. <laughs>